Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. God be with you. Amen. 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 Si su kalai se ko fekita nga if wa ke hengi hengi ko ya o sapate ko ha mai ta fo mo oi haleluya lord be with you this evening ladies and gentlemen i bring to you the good lord of the jesus christ here this evening ladies and gentlemen i bring to you the good name of the lord jesus christ here. Lord Jesus, I bring you his good name today. In a few months from now, the good Lord, good Lord will, him, will be raised up in the child of God, in the name of Jesus. In the name of the hallelujah, the almighty. Amen. Amen. I bring the good news of the good Lord to you on the invitation of a very good friend here. His name is Reverend Alai Atu Palere. He came to meet me and he said to me, it has been a long, long time we have not seen each other. It has been a long, long time we have not spoken to each other. A long time you have lived and I have lived. But today the good Lord has brought you here. May I invite you to come to our ministry to share the good life and the good fortunes of the good Lord. Hallelujah. I wasn't going to come today. But the good Lord said, go. Go to the desert. Go to where the difficulties are. I looked at the program and the program said, your name has been written on. The original name today is Lord Marfil. I speak for Lord Marfo in the name of the good Lord. My name is Lord Vaya. I speak for the good Lord in the name of Marfo. Because the name has been struck out and my name has been inserted. Shall I not forget him? No, Lord. Stay with him, Lord. For that is why I've called upon you today. I bring the good news of today. Before this house was constructed, this was all bush. All this was all bush. The noble of this area at that time was noble to he was a member of your ministry. We shared our prayer. We broke bread. And he said to us one day, because for seven years we prayed every Thursday. Five o'clock in the morning, we prayed. We shared breakfast. Lord Fafanua, tu do tas Fafanua. Baron, are you motu a filakepa? Lord Manuuri Luani and His Serene Highness Prince Mairefihi Pibrihake. Out there. This, hallelujah, Lord. This is why I have come. Because I was invited here and I said to Reverend Atpalede, the Lord has called me to share this message with you. Before you congregated, 
The young nobles, we were seated there. Early in the morning, five o'clock, we had breakfast. There was only a kitchen there. This is all, there's nothing here. Just all grass, tall grass. Lord Dutotasi has died, passed on, respect to him. Baron Filakepa has passed on, respect to him. Lord Laumanuri Nuani has passed on, respect to him. His Serene Highness, Prince Marifihi, Tribriaki, has passed on. I bring you today Hallelujah. their message. Yes. Let's not we forget those who have prayed ahead of you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I have cried, I have sung, I have lived all my life, but I have never forgotten the name of Jesus Christ. I have cried and I have loved, I have laughed and I have enjoyed, but I have never forgotten the name of Jesus Christ. This evening I bring to you the good name, the good Lord and the message. A message that comes from within and a message that comes in from around who we are and who we want to be. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you touched by God? Yes. Touched by Jesus? Yes. I will sing that song later. <laughs> I am very happy to be here today. I am very happy and honored to be here today. I bring you the message and I bring laughter to myself as I stand before you. Amen. Why? Because of what happened yesterday. The young nobles were sitting outside there. The name of our program was called a navigator. We prayed, we shared, we spoke, we understood. But I didn't realize that I'll come here to stand before you. I didn't realize I'll come here and say to you, they have gone. But living the message of the good word of God, it is here today. Amen. Jesse, in many a times I have heard your voices sing. In many a times I have seen you sing. And many a times I have thought as you all sung like the young ladies behind me. What a wonderful world. Yeah. What a beautiful voices here. How often do we get voices? You are given voices. You are provided strength to live with God and praise God. Hallelujah. Jesus gave you today. Jesus gave you yesterday. And I will always remember the Psalm 139. A Psalm that tells, keep your love and your obedience for God and no one else. Lord Jesus, I bring you the good faith of those who were here, the young nobles of yesterday. Lord Jesus, I bring you their faith today because they're not here in body, but their spirit still lives. How did I know I was going to be here? How did I know I will speak in front of you? Why did I say it, it was no good to come and go to prayer in a kitchen? Five o'clock in the morning, there's nobody else here. Did I know? On the 21st of November 2018, I didn't know I'll be here. Wow. Today I'm here because of what they did yesterday. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus, stay with us. Amen. Stay here with us. Amen. On the Psalm 139, it says, God says, before you were born, I knew you. Before you knew what to say, I told you. Before you thought you could escape me, I knew you. Hallelujah, God. 
Praise the Lord Jesus Christ that we are here today. Are you telling me something different? Are you saying something that is beyond? And the psalm says, Let it be known. It is I gave you this. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. The Lord gave you. The Lord provided you. The Lord gave you wealth. The Lord gave you health. The Lord gave you everything. And only on one condition. The day that he wanted you to pray for him was only one day. Only one day. Out of the seven days that you live, only on the Sabbath that he called upon you. Treasure what I have given, for I will always take. But the spirit that I leave, you leave with me. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 God be with you. Amen. In a lot of life, in a lot of ways that we live, too often we think we are great. Too often we believe ourselves to be who we are. Too often we say, I am who I am because I want to be who I am. No, the good Lord said no. The good Lord said, I gave you the spirit. Amen. I gave you the breath. I gave you the life. Like a bird in the sky, you will fly and eat the fruits that I have given on the trees. Like the rivers that I have provided, so you can drink and be at full. Hallelujah, Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. This is why I have come. This is why I'm here. An unfortunate time and a time that I did not know I will be here until my good friend, Ad Balele said, Baya, show me the Lord in your city. Baya, show me the good gospel in the Walofa. Baya, where is the only people in the world that obey Sunday? Only in the kingdom of Tonga that we live. Only in the kingdom that we praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. The, the young girls behind me, when I was sitting up in front there, I said to myself, don't challenge him on the singing. <laughs> I said to myself, come back next week and speak and sing. Lord, if that was the life you wanted me to be, you would have given me a lot of other chances and I wouldn't be here. But because you have given me today's opportunity, I am like the poor. I am like the dumb. I am like the deaf. How often do you count those people out, Lord? You never count the dumb and the deaf. You call those people your children. So girls, if I sing out of tune, close your eyes and... <laughs> you know, when you're in trouble a lot, in this world, there are two things that you do. One, you go to a lawyer and you go, lawyer, what's my right? How can I get out of this? Lawyer, how much would this cost? Lawyer, as soon as you get me off, I'll pay you. What does the law say to me, lawyer? Of course, what can the lawyer say? You are right. You are might. You can be what you want to be. 
as long as you pay me. You are right. You are might. You will always be right as long as you pay me. That's all. That's what the lawyer said. He goes up to the accountant. He goes, how much is my wealth? The accountant goes, this is how much you're worth. Is it right? The account goes, it is right. Your might and what you want will always be right as long as you pay me. Then the person went up to God and God said, he said, God, what can you do for me? God said, what can I do for you? What are you going to do for me? I've given you a hundred years of your life. I've given you a house. I've given you a wife. I've given you children. I've given you a car. I've given you all the pleasures of life. Now you demand for me to give you more. All I ask is that you praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Call upon him when you need him. Amen. You know that song? It goes, mm, Sometimes in my life I have a food. Sing with me, sing with me. I have a food. Ah, uh, yeah, when you're not great, yes. and where's tomorrow? Lean on me, yeah. when you're not strong, and I'll be your friend. Just call on me, brother, when you need a hand. We all need somebody to lean on. We just call on me, brother, when you need a hand. We all need somebody to lean on. Praise the Lord. Sing that song when you need help. Amen. Call that number when you need assistance. And praise the Lord. That's a direct call to Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Lord, we thank you for this evening. Amen. But I, I'm sorry that I have mentioned the lawyer. <laughs> it was not intended for you. It was intended for the conscience of the person who lives on us. Ask yourself. Don't ask the lawyer. Believe in God. And that will be the righteousness. Nothing to do with Fadai Waihu. No. <laughs> Lastly, I bring to you today a message that is always very, very difficult nowadays in Tonga. A, diff a difficult message that I find you ha have answered here at the ministry. You have brought the children together to be with you. Too many people nowadays are on this, on that. Too many people say, I don't have this, I don't have that. Too many people say this, I want to live overseas. I don't want to live here. But God, where is God with you? And that is where you want to be. God and Tonga are my heritage. God precedes Tonga. God, we 
lean on to him. We do not in any way decide to say, Tonga and God. No. God first, and then Tonga. And that is what it is, and that is what will be. If you forget that, you will never be there, and you will never be called upon. Let God call on you. Let him be the decider. For there is a will and a heaven beyond what we believe and what we see. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. May the good Lord be with you. Amen. May the good Lord stay with you. Amen. May the Lord give you blessings Amen. and give you understanding. As we progress in life, like the sun, like the midday sun, like the afternoon and the evening. That is your life. You start off slowly. You become very bright during the day. And then towards dawn, towards the evening, you fade. And that's when the good Lord comes back to provide you. Thank you for inviting me here tonight. Thank you for allowing me to share the gospel tonight. May the good Lord stay with you always. May Merry Christmas with you and a Happy New Year. Amen. Praise the Lord.